Hey everyone, it is the Bat Prototype, and this is going to be my first Let's Play, and I am playing Attack of the B Team. So what we're going to do is just go, other than <laughs> I always, anytime I start a new game, I do opt for the, I guess some people would call it the cheat chest, uh, so I do have that um, as my beginning, so let us start. So this will be fun. <laughs> so I automatically got <clears throat> two books, and one is the open block, which kind of tells you in Attack of the B Team what you can do uh, with some blocks. Um, but this is something to get into later down the road when I have supplies to actually do some of this. And then the wonderful, wonderful option of the, uh, what's it, like the smeltery, um, uh, Tinker's Construct. This is the book that tells you how to do that, and most of this can be made immediately once you have some wood, and is extremely useful, but again, I'll get into that a little bit later in game, so I'm gonna, oh, I'm in creative, that's fun. <laughs> so, put that in there, and I hear some sheepies, and I plan on killing them. <laughs> Sometimes you get really useless stuff in these chests, but ha, I actually got food this time, which is nice to start off, because that can be a bit of a pain. A nice wooden pick wooden axe, some sticks, and some wood. Now, as I've shown you in regular to Minecraft tutorials, the crafting table is like absolutely necessary. Actually, I'm gonna just make that all wood. Mm. Yes, cow, I hear you. Make a sword and a shovel. These are kind of your necessities anyway, so right off the bat. Now, being I was lucky enough to spawn, haha, -ha, here's something I can talk about. Um, so, <laughs> eventually I will go into tutorials and explain this more, but Attack of the Bee Team has this mod called Morph, and basically any individual type entity you kill, you then now can be that entity. <laughs> Let me see if I can... Whoop. I can never... Damn it. <laughs> I can never remember. There we go. See, I'm a cow now. Really entertaining. Not so much. So I'm going to turn back to this. And a lot of things I'm going to kill for the first time. I'm just going to go back to my normal lovely creature. Oh, and this is really nice. Um, some blueberry bushes, and I think those are raspberry? Yes, I know you want my attention. Which I don't necessarily need to grab them all, but I'm gonna anyways, because though these don't give a lot of food uh, or hunger satisfaction, um, they're still useful. Let me see which one that was. I apologize if you can hear my kid, like, being obnoxious in the background. He's, he's having some fun. Okay. Yep, I was right. That was raspberries. Now, I do play on a fairly popular server, and later down the road, I will um, kind of review or talk about servers. But right now, we're just going to be playing. I think I got it all. All right. And I think this is some barley. Just getting all the food stuffs I can. Barley can be made into bread and a few other useful things. Um, it's pretty easy to actually get food stuffs in Attack of the B Team. Where'd that sheepy go? <laughs> so, another point I wanted to make. Now, if you've watched the trailer to my channel, die! Um, 
I have mentioned I am legally blind, so there are times where I might struggle to see or read the books or see creatures, maybe you do. Um, so just, just a reminder. <laughs> so you're watching a blind person play, so let's, let's see how many. Uh, only one wool. Come on now. Come on now. Something's in the water somewhere. I hear it. It's not me. Hmm. I don't know. Alright, I'm gonna kill a few more things. Now, I can eventually make um, some backpacks, but right now I don't have enough stuff to make it. Ha! Ah, ah. Death to you. Ooh, now, one thing I love about the server, not server, but uh, this mod is um, its vast amount of uh, trees. Now, it's of course not one of the mods that has <clears throat> has a lot um, compared to say like what is it um, uh, like um, feed the beast has an abundant hex that has abundance of it um, but you know I do like I don't know which which mod is this yeah the nature mod it has some gorgeous gorgeous um, trees and I just love the Sakura it's not because I'm a girl that I like pink okay I actually don't like pink all that much but I'm going to get some saplings come on now and I'm gonna need to either go underground soon because I see the light is starting to fade just a little bit come on now um, and get some cobble because I need to make some stuff better than wood sometimes this can be really <laughs> sometimes the trees don't completely dissolve because they're attached to the ground somewhere. It's just annoying. Just give me some saplings. Give me some saplings. Yeah, I'm not seeing any damn saplings. Come on now. I'm sure this is just as entertaining for you as it is for me. Ooh. Okay. So, one of the things that this mod has is along with many others they have gravel that holds ore now at the beginning it's really hard to get these unless you have at least a cobble but a lot of them you might need a um, uh, <laughs> uh, I am drawing a blank oh iron but here's a trick if you don't have the equipment you dig down one block, and it has to be a solid block that won't fall like gravel, um, such as here. Put a torch there, break that, ta-da! Now you got it. All right, now there's a few, looks like there's a few more. Woohoo! And I can smelt these later. Uh, is there any more? Yep, yep, yep. Just, I always make sure to pick up these because I'm limited at this moment. Mm -hmm. Looks like there's some limestone. Now, I'll just double checking. Oh, yeah, there is one more. It's kind of interesting. I don't think I've ever seen it. For all the game time I've spent on this, I've never seen um, in any mod actually <laughs> that type of gravel actually be on top of a tree. It's kind of interesting. There should be a piece of it somewhere around here. I did see some of them break. Oh, I'm hurry. 
Ah, hell. I'll take what I got. I see a chicken down there. Oh, no. Go, 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 go. Bam. Nah, I'm a chicken. Fun times for me. Oh, do I have a lot of milk? I'm not sure why it's not. Pick it up. Uh, another thing I really like about this game is that um, its objects float, so it doesn't like hang like underwater. I'm not sure why it's I'm not picking that up. Well, at this point, I don't care. <laughs> gonna dig myself. Oh, with the morph, you really do turn into these creatures, so being I'm a chicken, I'm only one block high, so it's actually very useful in, um, there's less blocks you need to break to get through. Oh, limestone. I want some regular stone, so, because I need to make some stone equipment so I can get any ore that comes up and also ooh, look what I found uh, and make a furnace so I can cook some meat all right I'm gonna make myself big since I am in a two-story area and really the only thing that's gonna be able to come through there is a running itty bitty zombie really and I'm not too worried about that. Alright, 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 alright. So there's our cobble. Come on. And really the main one you want to cover with cobble. I didn't make any sticks now did I? Um. <clears throat> is uh, the pickaxe, because that's the one thing you're going to need to have a lot for. <laughs> my child's very excited. I got him, or me and my husband both, got him a uh, Minecraft for the Wii U. So that's entertaining. <laughs> Alright, now let us replace that axe with that you know all right <laughs> sometimes I just don't think what I'm doing and end up screwing up oh well now because I do have some wood I can cook some meat now let's see can I break that no or if I do it won't drop anything. Now we'll stone break it. Yes, it will. And what was that? Tin, which will be useful down the road. I see redstone, and I've got to tell you, I really don't like redstone. Uh, it's very necessary in a lot of um, in a lot of recipes, but right now it's super not needed, <laughs> and. It, redstone is one of those that you would need iron to break. So at this point, I think I'm going to stop the recording. Um, and I will see you in the next Let's Play. And also, if you guys have any comments or questions having to do with this Let's Play or any other tutorials, let me know. And if you guys want me to do anything in particular in my Let's Play, let me know. Alright? I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!